The largest labor union in Eskom is seeking a 15% wage increase even if the utility company cannot produce enough electricity to meet the country's needs, causing nationwide blackouts. The National Union of Mine Workers said in a copy of the letter sent to Eskom by Bloomberg that it wants the same raise for all workers, alongside other increases in allowances for housing and other benefits. Wage negotiations in the civil service come at a contentious time for Eskom and South Africa. Measures implemented by President Cyril Ramaphosa to end blackouts include expanding program to purchase renewable energy, a withdrawn national disaster relief and appointing power minister, but the ongoing cuts have deepened in recent days. The Labour Party signed a one-year contract with Eskom in 2022 after violent protests that kept some workers from going to office and increased power outages that contributed to the all-time record. Eskom employees are not legally allowed to strike because providing electricity is considered a basic service. Solidarity, another public sector labor union, also submitted a demand for a wage increase of 3 percentage points above the average inflation rate. South Africa's average inflation rate was 6.9% last year, and the central bank will slow to 6% for 2023.